It makes a lot of difference when you send a PDF like this and like this. Hey, Shivam here. Today we will talk about an app I found on AppSumo named Flipbooklet that will turn boring PDFs into interactive flipbooks. If at any point you want to check it out, then you can do so from the discount link in the description. When I visited their website, it was quite simple. I quickly logged in and visited the dashboard. It first shows the account overview, which displays the total number of books we have made and the number of views on those. Upon viewing the books, it shows the overview of the book data, like the title, link for sharing, a PDF version, embed, analytics, and actions to view, edit, and delete it. Let's create a new booklet for this video. First, we will click on the create new book, which takes us to this page. Here we add the title of the book and choose the custom URL. Then we choose the PDF. It comes with a size limit of 50 MB. So if you have a large PDF, you will have to upgrade your plan. It will also enable us to add a custom domain. As you can see, there is an SEO box which will help us optimize it for search. There's also an option at the bottom to disable the indexing. A good practice is to always fill your meta title and description as it helps to boost your ranking on search engines. You can also change the design a little. It doesn't do a lot and you can only change the icon and the background color. You cannot select page turn animations or create interactive elements inside the book, which I feel is a downside of this app. You can change the reading mode from right to left, disable sounds, disable the toolbar and change the page type if you opt for more expensive plans. Soon they will also let you capture emails for lead generation and honestly, I am waiting for this feature. There are some privacy options too like disabling downloads and search indexing, disabling scripts and cookies and protecting it with a password is in the next plan upgrade. I don't like that these simple features are not included in the base plan. After this, you can hit create button. It will take around 10 to 30 seconds to make the book. And here are the results. That was way engaging than the normal PDF. After you are done with the books, you can also make small changes to it, like changing the icon, background color, and pages. So here are the things that I like about the flip booklets. It was easy to use and on point, not many buttons or things to get distracted by. It took me only a minute to make a flip book. It has search engine indexing functionality that helps us in getting more reach if you are looking for that. And of course, there were some things that I didn't like about it. Lack of customization options. Even though Flip Booklets is a good software, it falls short on customization options. There are some basic things it can do, but not beyond that. It may get boring after a while if you keep seeing the same recipe over and over again, as Flip Booklets lack interactions and cannot make the experience more immersive. Also, the interface is quite basic and does its job. As far as the pricing is concerned, there is a free plan, though it's just for the sake of trying the service. On the free plan, you can create only one book for up to 10 MB in size and keep it with you forever. However, you won't be able to customize it even slightly. If you want to hop onto the paid plans, you have two options to go with. Either you can get it from them or from the app Sumo. I would prefer AppSumo as it costs less and it's a lifetime subscription. On AppSumo, there are three lifetime plans for $49, $98 and $147. That is comparable to their Startup, Startup Plus and Business Plus plans. And the pricing is there on the screen for you to see. If you look closely, you will find the AppSumo deal to be much more enticing. You can check it out on the discount link in the description below. I would say that if you have to showcase your PDFs like your portfolio, projects, etc. from time to time, then rather than sending it by mail, you must use this app. It will showcase it in a much better way. I would recommend this tool for students, freelancers and corporate people. However, that's it for today. If you are looking for the best PDF apps, then this video is definitely for you. And if you are looking for the lifetime cloud storage deal, then there you go. That's it for today. Hope you guys found it helpful. Like, share, subscribe. Stay safe. Bye-bye.